unicorns and glitter and taxidermy critters are just some of the things they like. They also enjoy 80s hair bands, Grizzly Adams and John Goodman, so if you think that's weird then you can take a hike. But the things they enjoy the most are making art and cracking jokes. So without further ado, here are your hosts. You've got your two artsy gals, your two artsy gals. Here are your two artsy gals. Hey listeners, I hope you are having a fantastic, um... I almost said Halloween. Holy shit. Thanksgiving weekend. I am exhausted from our driving and eating a ton of turkey and hanging out with family yesterday. So it is late. I almost forgot to post this. So I'm going to make this as quick as I can and then I'm going to go to bed, man. Damn. Um, there's a little bumping around on here and I apologize for that. As you remember from last week, our cord went bad. The cord to our mixer. Um, the power supply box in the cord specifically, I think. So I do have a new one, but we recorded this before the new one came. So one more episode of the weird noise in the background, bumpy things, and then I promise we're back to normal. Uh, this is a Katie and Lonnie doing stuff together episode. It was super fun and hilarious. Just a heads up. I know you know that we swear and that you probably are not listening to the episode or our podcast in front of people who you don't want to hear swearing stuff. But this one is kind of heavy on the swears because we make, we well, as you'll soon find out, we used swear words in our project, our glass etching project. So, and we laughed really hard and it's going to be really hilarious, but just, you know, you don't want grandma here and that. Unless, of course, your grandma likes swearing. And then, hello, grandma. Welcome to the podcast. We love you. Uh, you can support this podcast in a few ways. Uh, you can donate money to the podcast through our website, tourcygals.com, by clicking the PayPal donate button on the website. Super easy. You can do a one-time donation. You can do a monthly donation. Whatever you want. You can also support us by on this, uh, clicking on our Amazon wishlist button. Sorry, I had something in my mouth. That was weird. It was a dog hair. Ew. Uh, you can donate items to the show. We have an Amazon wishlist. And when you click the Amazon wishlist button from our website, touristygals.com, it will take you directly to our wishlist. And you can buy something and send it to us. And we will do a Katie and Lonnie doing stuff episode. And thank you. And talk about the cool thing that you sent us. Um, you can also support the show just by telling everybody about us. Um, you're going to be with your relatives and friends this weekend doing Thanksgiving stuff. Uh, turn some relatives on to podcasts. Do you, I know. I know it's hard to believe, but there are some people that just do not listen to podcasts. A lot of people don't know how. You might have to show your grandma how to do it. Load it up on her iPhone for her. Say, Grandma, you're going to love these bitches. And then get it all set up. Welcome, Grandma you're in for a great time. Um, you can also support us by leaving positive feedback for us in places. So when you subscribe to us on iTunes or Stitcher or Google Play or using the, or the Podomatic app uh, and you're using those free apps, all of those places have free apps, uh, stop by and give us some awesome number of stars, like four or five stars, and then say something cool about us. Because then it bumps us up in the algorithm for people searching for like arts and crafts podcasts. We'll show up higher in the numbers or like closer to the top if we have more comments and feedback. So please do that. That is an excellent way to support us. Anything else? Oh yeah. Follow us on all the social medias. We're going to have pictures of the cool shit that we did today on our website. So you'll want to go there to rcgals.com. But if you want to know when that is up and everything is posted, you can go follow us on Facebook. We post all the stuff on Facebook. So go there, um, subscribe, uh, like us on the Facebook, and then you'll know as soon as this goes up and you'll be able to go click and go straight to our website through a handy dandy link that I will personally post for you and your grandma. Um, let me see. Oh, you can also follow us on Instagram and Twitter and we have a Pinterest page and we always have cool examples for you so you're going to want to subscribe to a Pinterest also. Um, 
you can email us and say, Katie, you say um too much when you're just riffing these intros off the top of your head, or you can tell us that you love us, or you can tell us anything. You can show pictures of your Thanksgiving crafts or anything that you did for your Thanksgiving holiday. Um, We will share them with our audience. We love it. When you email us, you can do that by emailing to our gals at gmail.com, or you can call us at 503-395-7190 and just tell us how awesome you think we are. Oh my God, leave us drunk Thanksgiving messages. Those would be the best thing ever. I mean, I know that Thanksgiving's over, but you let's face it, you have a whole fucking weekend with your family now because it's a long goddamn weekend because some a-hole decided that Thanksgiving should be on Thursday. And so now you're stuck with your fucking family. Listen to us, have some drinks, and then call and leave us funny messages. I think that's everything for today. I'm sure I'm forgetting something. But again, I'm tired and you're probably tired to listen to me jibber jabber. You just want to listen to the fucking show. So here you go. Hey everybody, this is Katie. And this is Lonnie. And we're two artsy gals. <laughs> Being a little bit creepy. So this is a Katie and Lonnie doing stuff episode, guys. So you gotta hear Kurt's little song. Yeah. I'm glad you said that so that that will be my reminder to edit that in. Because it's so funny. It's pretty cute. Yeah. Katie and Lonnie are doing stuff. Katie and Lonnie, they do lots of stuff. So, so what are we doing, Katie? We are doing glass etching. As cheeks and glass. Oh, BT Dubs, this is, it's Happy Thanksgiving, guys, because oh. this is airing on thanksgiving i hope you, everything's going well i hope you're doing good i maybe you're in a turkey coma maybe you're hiding in the bathroom maybe you're smoking a bowl in the garage because <laughs> grandma's stressing your shit out <laughs> so it happens in my house <laughs> um maybe you're drunk maybe you're maybe your dog is barking your dog maybe you're having a vegetarian yeah, maybe you're having a sad Thanksgiving because you have to have a fucking tilt turkey. <laughs> Sorry about your luck, yo. <laughs> we have, my son has a friend who <clears throat> does Thanksgiving at our house every year because he and his dad go to his aunt's house and she's a vegetarian and they have tilt turkey. And it makes him sad. <laughs> I'm him. curious. I want to try it. <sighs> So these are beautiful little delicate um, stencils that Katie made. Yeah, and I used my, I have a cutting machine that I finally got to use. It's been, I've had it for, geez, almost two years. But it wouldn't work on my, I couldn't install the software on my PC because every time I tried to use it, it would make my PC crash. So now that I have a Mac, I installed it and now I'm able to use it. I'm so, going to open this press and seal wrap. All right. So basically, I'm going to go do the rundown of what we're talking, what we're doing here. Okay. Well, Lonnie and I right now are cleaning out our stencils. Or in the stencil using world, apparently, there's a th- this is a big thing. It's called weeding when you pull what you don't want in your stencils. So. I think behind you, Lonnie, I have put a wooden spoon out. Bonnie looks very confused by this shit. There's a cutter on the edge of the box somewhere. Um, Are we still recording? Oh, we are. So I have cut out some very delicate stencils. (laughs) Lonnie is having a problem. I think there are scissors somewhere in my shitty, messy office. Oh, I also have these just in case. cutter is just just stupid. Yeah, I got it. Oh my god, an avalanche just happened. So, I, we thought, we always think that the, it's hilarious when you see, like, teacups and stuff with, like, delicate little pretty cursive writing, (laughs) but it says, like, fuck you, or something like that. Like, it always cracks us up. So, Lonnie has this set of... Lonnie, first of all, I need you to answer something for me. Uh-huh. What the fuck is a trivet? I don't know. I just called it that. Um, like, so you're going to want... There's a wooden spoon behind you that you're going to want to use to okay. rub... Really, you have to rub really hard to get that to work, apparently. I just 
good because I just kind of fucked up. Um, where is it? I don't know. Trivet is a little thing you put little things in, right? Okay. You can I'm even just taking your word for it. You could use it as like a. Blanking Are on they the chargers? Things. Is it a charger? Because I feel like that's a charger. I okay. don't know. Why did I call it a trivet? I, I don't, don't know. know. They're little tiny fucking square glass plates. Yeah. That's all they are. Yeah. And so what I have these little plastic letters stuck all over me now. Um, I don't even know what I'm doing right now. Uh, we are. So I have printed off a whole bunch of teeny tiny little words and phrases like fuck you, and piss flaps, and I don't know. There's a bunch of them. Oh, yeah, I'm wrong, because a trivet is something you place under a hot serving dish. That's what I thought. Yeah. So these would be chargers, <laughs> but still... The, what's the charger? I don't fucking know. Where's this wooden Where spoon that you speak I don't of? know. Come on. <laughs> I was trying to find my Mod Podge scraper, but I don't know where the fuck that one either. Money, you're better at this than I am. No, getting these little things. I'm not. So you could just use. Also, there's like, I think you I, it, you need to rub really hard. Yeah, for them to and come I didn't up. place it correctly. So so I, you're probably wanna, gonna want to cut closer in around that. You still want to leave it. Um. Oh, I see. Cut my contact paper. Yeah, just kind of trim it around. Yeah. So I printed. I used my cutting machine. You have scissors. Son of a bitch. Why is everything not <laughs> where... Here they are. It's because I set stuff on top of them. Okay. Okay, sorry. What were you going to say? I was going to say, I used my cutting machine to make these little stencils with clear contact paper. Because we are doing chemical etching, is what we're doing right now. Um, I have a... I bought a container of Armor Etch, is what it's called. Glass etching cream. Um, causes burns, which may not be immediately painful or visible, may cause permanent damage to skin, eyes, and the respiratory tract. So, Lonnie, don't get this shit on your face, yo. Oh, okay. <laughs> or in your eyes. So, use the side of the scissor to kind of, like, mm -hmm. the handle to Making sure it's the right side, even, I don't know. So, what we do with this clear contact paper is that I have used... I printed, well, it's kind of like, you don't have a cut machine, it's kind of like a printer, but it cuts. So in my software, I, in my, like, I used Photoshop, I made all these little uh, phrases, and then I flipped them so that they would be backwards, because we're going to put them on the bottom of these plates so that it shows through the glass, because they're clear glass squares. Um, and... I think it's hilarious. I'm doing one right now that says ass face. <laughs> We're giggling and being juvenile. Uh-huh. Because it's a fun time. It is. So I think what we should do is get these all ready and then put the the um, stuff on them all at the same time so that they're all done at the same time. Okay. So we can right? stick them on and stuff. So yeah, since I made so much of this. I have another pair of scissors. I think I did it. Um, let's see. I'll find I almost out. feel like we're so like discombobulated when we do these efforts or efforts. So you want all of that, like the background to come up. Right. So I just peel the back of, hopefully just peeling the back of the contact paper. Hopefully. Will be the thing. We'll see. So I learned this trick uh, recently. A lot of people, you use this stuff called transfer paper when you're transferring stencils, but it's expensive. And you know, here at Two Arts of Gals, we don't actually like to, which side is the right side? It works, down. Katie, it works! Yeah! Yeah! Is this the side down? Like I, want I know. Um, it's this back side. Okay, it's yeah. a little bit sticky. I yeah, gotcha. I know. I so I learned this thing um, watching a video instead of spending a bunch of money on transfer paper this is so hilarious people use uh glad press and seal yeah so you are right now i'm kind of like scrubbing so you you do what's called weeding you weed out 
I use dental picks to get the parts of the stencil that I don't want in my stencil out. Like I've weeded those out. And now I'm rubbing, and I will put the video that I found for this. You might have to rub rub it down. Okay. To do it. Does it seem like it's sticking? No, yeah, I rubbed it down good. Oh, okay. yeah. um, I rubbed it down good. I rubbed it down good, baby. Yeah, I yeah. did. We're so fucking gross. <laughs> like, we're the grossest <laughs> fucking people on the planet. You guys get to talk like that. I want to talk like that, too. I'm going to rub it down. <laughs> You're going to grab yeah. it by the pussy? <laughs> We can joke now, right? I Thanks. dare you. I dare you to grab my bloody pussy. Ew, gross! <laughs> this is this is as cool as it is, almost. Oh my god, this is going to be so good. <laughs> Look, it's so, so good. good. <laughs> so, thank you for making these, Katie. Thank you so much. You, you so right excited. now, I'm kind of like okay. s- like scraping to make sure I that one. the, uh, oh, I want the good scissors. Okay. Let me use this really quick to cut. Um, you use the glad press and seal to put down over the top of, well, I should take pictures. Let me, when you do the next oh. one, I'll take a picture so we can post pictures. Okay. Uh, you do that. You press down, uh, scrub it. I can't think of the word that I'm trying to think of. I can't, that sentence is dumb. I can't think of the word, but you want it. You just want to make sure that it's really stuck down onto, like you scrub it. The yeah. glad press and seal onto your stencil and then you peel the backing off and it ta-da, that's so and cool and what the press and seal does is it holds everything like the insides of letters and the little dots over the eyes and it like makes your stencil hold together well and then you don't lose parts of it you don't get bubbles in it when you put it down and we're going to talk about bubbles in them in a minute and it allows you to transfer your whole stencil. So, like, if you've done something very delicate with, like, like uh, these. little <laughs> leaves or flowers or little details, um, like these little words, like lettering, it allows you to bring the whole stencil over and place it and not have to worry about losing bits and pieces of it or getting the bubble or whatever in there. This fucking works beautifully awesome. yeah it's Lonnie you and I are gonna have life is a dipshit Lonnie <laughs> please tell me that you're gonna use these to serve things at Thanksgiving this year. please <laughs> use them at Thanksgiving okay please that's hilarious um but I while we're doing this and maybe we <laughs> not were... at Scott's family celebration but at mine, no but yes. you do something at your house right yes every year <laughs> So, where are we stacking the ones that already oh, have? Oh, um, I just set it over here. I know. They look cool as just this. Bonnie even. and I were laughing so hard when we were, well, I don't know about you, but I was laughing when we were texting phrases back and forth. Yes. Um, because I was like, well, what, what kind of phrases do you want? Because I knew I wanted to do like, the, like this one's fuck off. And <laughs> piss flaps. Yeah, I got, us, I got piss flaps. Makes us both laugh. Yeah. So, uh. <laughs> so we were giggling and I said I have a vase that I was thinking about have some fucking flowers or something <laughs> so she goes what about smell these stinky fuckers <laughs> <laughs> so I have that <laughs> I can't wait to see <laughs> I really hope everybody thinks that we're as hilarious as we think we are I, I Because we are that fucking funny. 
So I want to talk a little bit about other options of glass etching too, because I did something last night. Um, you can buy, I think my brand is Krylon, but they make, there are several brands, um, spray, it's called the Frosted Glass Spray, I believe. Uh, and you can buy cans of that. Now, the good thing about the Frosted Glass Spray is that, like, I used it on our front window. And I took bunches of pictures. It looks guys. really cool. And I took a picture of Lonnie looking through it this morning when oh, I knocked man. on the door. When I'm she sure knocked on the looked... door. Really no. Lovely. Actually, the skeleton is over your face. Oh, good. That works. I did that on purpose because I thought it was cool. Yeah. Um, but... So I did a little skeleton with like shamrock crossbones, kind of. And why did my voice just? <laughs> I thought you were gonna weird. laugh. I thought you were like, yeah, my voice just did yourself. that. Um, I need a drink though. <laughs> You're like kind of. I know. Katie's so, voice is finally changing. I didn't use. I didn't have any press and seal. I had to have Lonnie grab it for me this morning on her way here. So I didn't use the press and seal. I've never used this stuff before. For transferring my stencil. And as you will see when you see the pictures, uh, there were a couple little bubbles when I transferred it over. And they the spray kind of made a little... It doesn't look bad. Like, you can't... But it, you can see it. So uh, this is... I'm so excited about this I am trick too. that I've learned. It's this pretty awesome. really cool. I remember doing glass etching in 4-H but I cannot for the life of me remember how we did the stencils it was a long time ago um, I did glass etching in high school in my art class I did but a little mirror with doves on we it we did mirrors and I don't remember yeah. whatever happened to it but we used um, <clears throat> we didn't use etching paste Our the wood shop had a sandblasting machine eyes. in it so we got to go over to the wood shop and we used contact paper on the mirror and I think we put our names or something in flowers or whatever. I don't remember, but we used, we sandblasted the glass, like the, the stencil. And that's how we got the etched glass. Oh, wow. It was really cool. Wow. And I, and the sandblaster was really cool. Cause it was like this big box oh, I've used one that of those you put before. stuff inside of, and then you have the gloves yeah. that you reach in and you sandblast. Those are cool. Well, that's pretty cool. I loved my fucking high school art teacher so much. He was great. He was my parents' art teacher, too. Yeah. My mom was just talking the other day about how I did much better in wood shop than I did in domestic... Uh, what was that class called? Home ec? Home ec. Yeah. I was better at wood shop. <laughs> I did good at home ec. I hated sewing then. I think it's because my mom did it. It was like this little yeah. rebellious thing. Like, Ugh, my mom sews. That's stupid. <laughs> I finally appreciate it now. Well, I, I need with a little encouragement. <laughs> Look at it. It looks so pretty even with just the contact paper. It does. Paper. Can you I'm imagine have to take a picture. <laughs> Don't get my messy office stuff Oh, I'll just there, get the window. Get the window. The pretty window. These Fs are not coming off very well. <laughs> Is that fuck off? Yeah. Is that the fuck off one? Look up. I love it when we do the doing stuff together episodes, okay. Lonnie. Me too. It's so much fun. My camera. <laughs> My phone is being a weirdo. I'm going to have to sniff this guy right here. Hello? My apps are stuck together. Lonnie, my apps are stuck together. What the fuck? Ha <laughs> ha, what the fuck? <laughs> My apps are stuck together and my fuck off. It's kind of hard to get a good picture of it. So do you but think that Scott is going to find these humorous? Or he's gonna, is he going to yeah. think we're ridiculous? Well, probably both. No. He'll think they're cool. He'll be like, what? You guys made those? I know. Kurt always... I was laughing maniacally to myself in here last night. When I printed off the smell these stinky fuckers <laughs> thing for the vase, or I guess I'm not printing it off. Um, I didn't mean that, like, you can't use the good scissors, by the way, Lonnie. I just wanted the good ones. Oh, oh yeah, no. I, those weren't cutting this yeah. stuff, so. No, I've been now using I feel like the an good ones. asshole. Like, no, I'm like, no. wait, did I just, like, say, those are my good scissors? No, you didn't even see me. I used oh. them for the. Okay, good. Yeah. 
I'm like, well, I'm going to use a good scissors, too. So these would be funny gifts, too. Like, the holidays yes. are coming up. Like, if your family is a private joke or something. like Totally. You know, yeah, like, or if someone has a nickname or I don't know. I almost want to get, like, make cereal bowls and be like, August fucking cereal and curse so- fucking cereal or something like that. <laughs> but I don't need another dish in my house. Eat your fucking Wheaties. My mother-in-law, when she got her... So, the reason that I have the uh, cutting machine, and I'm not going to say the brand name, partially because I want to do an episode about cutting machines at some point and things you can use them for, but also because these motherfuckers are dry, will drove me crazy. Like, I could not get this thing to work. It was, like, I was following all the instructions... How many weeks did it take? I can't even think. It took so many weeks to get, like, their fucking customer service is ridiculous. Like, I had this chain of, okay, I tried this. What about this? Like, emails going back and forth. It was all one train. They're like, well, can you put a video of you doing this, using it in there, or take a picture of this, or do that? So I did all the things they asked me to And I finally kept getting, like, different, like, try this and try that. And I'm like, this is brand new out of the fucking box. It should be working. And are you people not fucking reading the emails in the previous chain, uh, in the chain? Like, are are you not reading all of it? Like. Because were they repeating things? Yes. Like. Or they're like, maybe you should try this or it could be that. And I'm like, do you not even, like, I feel like you guys are just fucking guessing. Like. So, I'm not happy with, I'm learning to use it. I finally, we finally, finally got it figured out. Like, somebody finally said, oh, I went back and looked at the video that you sent, like, seven emails ago, and it doesn't look like you have it lined up on the right thing. So, blah de blah That appears to have been the issue. But still, I have a little trouble with the mat dripping sometimes. That's what the problem was. So, huh. I don't want to, I don't want to endorse them. I don't want to not endorse them. I just, I'm up in the air about how I feel about them right Until now. Until you use it for a while. Old cunt. That's the one I have. <laughs> <laughs> the old cunt. <laughs> <laughs> oh, jeez. We're such awful people, Mommy. It's Miss Old Cunt to you. Yeah. Mrs. How fucking funny would it be if like, you have this like mean, grumpy old relative and you you like serve, serve them, them like a dessert. A dessert on that. <laughs> so when they get to the bottom, it'll be like old cunt. But maybe they have like bad eyesight or something. So they're like, what does this say? Old country? Did yeah. you, did they spell it wrong? Did it fade? Yes. Oh my God. It used to say old country and it faded. That's what happened, mm. Grandma. <laughs> I was just using Grandma as an ex- I'm not saying anything about my grandma. Um, right. I'm not. I love my grandma. She's just kind of mean sometimes, but I love my grandma. Yeah, I had a mean grandma too. But I could never call her an old cunt. She would have Oh my died. god, I would have died. died. I love my grandma. She wants to call her mean so bad. <laughs> I do have to occasionally tell her that she should not be so mean, but you know. Is she in. Yeah. Oh, my grandma can be kind of mean. But I love my grandma. She's the only grandma I have left. Aww. Yeah. And I feel like I'm pretty lucky at 43 years old to have a grandparent. But you know, when my son was born, he had, not only did he have two great grandmothers and two great grandfathers, he had two great great grandmothers when he was born. But my great grandma wow. was still alive, and my ex's great grandma was still alive. Wow. You think I could sell these at the craft fair? I think you probably could. <laughs> I think they would kick me out. Oh, maybe. Oh, I don't, people are so sensitive about dying words. Know. What the fuck? But some people love them. I know there are people out there like us that love dirty words and find them funny. So. Probably at, like, the Crafty Wonderland or something. You could get away with it. Yeah. I feel like we should make some that say, like, make some cool shit, yo. Yeah. We could give them away. We could. Um, why are these stuck to me, Lonnie? Suck it. 
No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Suck it. Hey, this is perfect, because there we go. This stuff is going faster than I thought it was going to, actually. I was pretty concerned. Where's the good scissors? So, yeah, back to my front door. I did my front door because we have this problem at our house where my dog sees movement outside and he fucking barks. And we, across the street from our house, is a um, the, the backside and the parking Ooh. lot of a, an eye doctor. <laughs> so people are coming in and out of there all day long, going to get their eyeballs checked. And my dog barks every time he sees someone pull up over there, because we have this, the we have a skinny window the length of our front door, beside our front door. This and might be a little crooked, but it won't matter. Right? No, it won't matter. <laughs> so my dog barks all the fucking time. My dog sees a squirrel in the front yard. My dog barks all the fucking time. So I have been wanting to make that window, like it's a weird window to get a curtain for, um, or to make a curtain for, and quite frankly, we rent this house, and I really, really don't want to do. Also, Lonnie, I have, those are for the oh, bases. Oh. I have these other stencils, too, that I wanted to try. Oh, so maybe okay. you can use those on your yeah. glasses, too. Oh, and this is the 2016 yeah, one. Yeah, the 2016 one that you were... But anyway, yeah. um, thanks. The cool thing about oh wait, I was gonna oh. put, put this on there. Meow. You want old cut, right? Yeah. Okay, we had too many. Yeah. I did make. But I could do this on the glass. Okay. Yeah. But it's pretty big too, but. Um, mm -hmm. Oh, but it's backwards. It is backwards. You would have to do it on the inside of the glass. Oh. But there might be an extra. Hold on. Nope. I thought I had extra things, but I don't think I do. Anyway, um, the reason I, it occurred to me that I could use the like spray etching stuff, which is like makes it look like etched glass, but it is just frosted glass. Um, sorry, you had to have one. That's yeah, I did. Yes. Um, it's frosted glass. And you spray it. So this is a rental. When we move out, I can just get a razor blade and scrape all that off the glass. And it'll be like it was never there. It's, nice. So it's not an irreversible thing. Like this stuff, the armor etch is permanent. Like you are etching that shit forever and ever. Like. Oh, these are cool. Yeah, I got those. I found those at Fred Meyer on sale yesterday when I was getting something else. So. Um, what should my glasses say? Um, yeah, and I got two so that there would be, like, duplicates of letters. See what I'm saying, you know? Like, you would have more than one yeah. E or weren't more than one. So, I'm wondering. I was going to, yeah, I think I'm going to have to do this on this one. And this on this one. Because this is a weird shape, so. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm just trying to decide what I'm going to do with these. It's so exciting. Okay. Um. It worked pretty well, though, I think. I like, here's the thing that I, the challenge that I found with the spray, and I, like I said, I think that the brand that I got was Krylon. They make all kinds of different brands. And also, you should note, they make beach glass colors, too. So it's frosted, but it's like, like, green, that green oh, of beach glass. So they do, they do colors also. Um, I just got the plain old out. I just poked myself with a dental pick. Um, we're using dental picks to pick the stencils out. Uh, I bought that. And dude, I totally forgot that, like, I don't know about other states, but Oregon does not want you to huff paint. So in Oregon, you have to, when I went to the hardware store down the street from our house yesterday, or the day before, no, wait, I think I got bought it on Monday, actually. Um, you have to, like, sign... The, like the spray paint and stuff is locked up and you have to sign a sheet with your name and your driver's license number when you buy that shit. Do you have to do that in Washington, Bonnie? Uh, not that I remember. They definitely last time, well, they had it locked up, but I didn't have to sign anything. I don't know. I should, we should ask your brother if that's like, 
just a boy policy or because he works in an a boy right um a true value a true value okay we should ask him if that's like state policy or just like a that yeah it seems like it's store. some kind of law but like we don't want you huffing your huffing some paint here or tagging. Know, it's not good for you know. or tagging tagging what a bunch of jerks Somebody drew a really ugly vagina on the <laughs> the wall, the cement wall across the, on the other side of Barber from us. Aww. And it was there for a long time. And August was like, Mom, I feel weird and embarrassed every time we drive past this together. <laughs> he was still in high school. And I said, well, August, if it makes you feel any better, whoever did that does not know what a vagina looks like. <laughs> but you Just knew it saying. was a vagina. Because it said vag by it. Oh, okay, okay. I mean, like, it was the general idea <laughs> of a vagina, but um, it was a pretty messed up looking vagina. I'm going to make my mug, this mug say, suck on this. <laughs> suck it. <laughs> I thought my mom would think we were awful. I told her we were doing this last night, and she laughed. She thought it was funny. Yay. So, she's she's like, oh, more. you girls. <laughs> you girls are so silly yes we is we is it's These funny are to cool. me you can reuse them yeah they're reusable but little stencils that i got for they're like 349 a piece oh my god uh they're like little cool sticky stencils Sorry, I just throw that at you no yeah. put that garbage on me that's yeah, aggressive whatever because i took her last fucking charger plate away and went no i'm using that one uh -huh. I feel like I'm sorry, Lonnie. Was I being a jerk? No, because I want a you wanted the old charger cunt. that says "old cunt" or a <laughs> dessert plate. Dessert plate. I feel like we get too quiet here, but we're kind of concentrating. Okay, yeah, like I'm kind of concentrating on the middle of my lowercase s came out, and I want it to stay there. I'm gonna put a heart. Suck on this. Suck on my heart. <laughs> Yeah, wait, that don't make no sense. No, but it could be like, suck on this. Love you. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Because I say that kind of stuff to my husband all the time. This is fun. He thinks I'm weird. He told me this morning, you're so weird. <sighs> he just doesn't get it, But man. he thinks it's like cute. Like, not bad weird. He thinks it's cute that I'm weird, apparently. There we go. That is probably... Maybe I should put... Because our cats always try to drink out of our our water. Like, not for cats. Fuck off, kitty. Yeah, fuck off, kitty. <laughs> I say that to my kitty sometimes. Yeah. That's the whole reason we started getting more water bottles around here. Because we used to drink out of... Like, I used to just have a glass of water on my nightstand. But my cat is a dick and she tips it over on me while I'm sleeping. Which is super rude. It's a rude thing to do. It is. Lonnie, what are you doing for Thanksgiving, by the way? What are uh, your Thanksgiving plans? We are going to Scott's family thing on Thursday. And they make delicious food. And it's going to be good. Yummy. And then the next day, I usually make a turkey for my family at my house. Holy shit, I think my son's at home. I think he heard us laughing. Probably. Actually, I'm not even taking pictures of what we're doing. That's okay, because we'll take pictures of the final things, because you can't really see these very well, like the stem stencils. I have plenty of, of pictures. This one shows. I have a ton of pictures of my front door. K's for my kitty. Kitty. And then my F's. Hmm. Um, so you do your family at your house the day after? Like, does your whole family come or does it just your brother or? Uh, like my mom and sister in law and um, nieces and stuff. Wait, you have nieces? And my nephew. Yes, because my, um, my brother's wife had three kids when they got married. Oh, that's right. I forgot about that. I did. I just went to 
um, my niece's bridal shower, and it was actually really fun. We did the paper, toilet paper wedding dress thing and played games, played bingo with the presents. Like, you guess what they're going to get, and then, I don't know. It was really, it was fun. Wait, didn't this, um, did this niece get engaged while we were, when I met your brother and sister-in-law? That was the other 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 kid, yeah. So they're all going to be married now. So yeah. That's crazy. So she has older kids. And then how old is your nephew? He's, oh my gosh. Sorry, Larry. I think he's 10. Wow. It's like two different players at once almost. Yeah. I really want this to say fuck no, kitty, but I don't have the K now. Oh yeah, because the K there... Well, you could make this say make, something else. Yeah. Because you can take those off. That's true. All the good swords have a K in them. <laughs> so, yeah. Yeah, we're going to... Um, well, we're going... The week before Thanksgiving, we're going down to my family's because my grandma is turning 88. And we're going to celebrate her birthday. So we are going to my husband's family's. Probably his sister's house. They have a cute new house. Um, So we'll go there for turkey day. Nice. To eat some delicious turkey. And I feel like there it is. This is not sticking where I want it to, Mommy. It's pissing me off. This is why I'm getting quiet because I'm concentrating. <laughs> it can be, yeah, it's tough. Uh, these little stencils can be kind of delicate. Yeah, especially the, uh, like, I was having trouble with the middle of an E. Yes. Like the circle part in the middle of the E. Let me see if I can get this to say not for Kitty. I feel like maybe we should stop recording for a while. And then come back? And then come back because we're getting really quiet. Okay. So I think what we're going to do is that we're going to stop recording. And Lonnie and I are going to smear the bad stuff on the... Or the etching stuff on our stuff. And then we will rinse it off. And come back when we reveal, because we've been recording for, yeah, it's about a half an hour. So we'll come back and we'll talk about this when we are done, when there, when we have something cool to show you guys. And of course, we are going to be posting rad pictures of this on our website, tourcygals.com. But I also know that my son's going to come out that door hot any minute and be all like, what the fuck? You guys are loud. <laughs> so anyway we'll be back okay guys we're back yeah um fyi this stuff smells like a big nasty fart oh my god yeah like like it stinks like we farts. should have had the windows open yeah. egg farty grossness yeah um and we've rinsed it all off it only took three minutes to let this stuff set um, so Lonnie is going to record the, are you recording? Now I am. She's going to do the reveal of the first one. So we're going to pull off this little section here of stencil. Oh, can't really see Make sure it all comes yeah, off and then we're going to pick up the, wait, where's my little doodad? There it is. This little guy, these dental picks come in handy. Yo, I'm telling you, you need to order some for yourself. Ew, that sounds not nice. You pull up the middle. Oh, yeah. Of these guys. Ah! My ear holes. There you <laughs> go. And let's sit down. <laughs> <laughs> that is so beautiful. These are the best things <laughs> yes. ever. Yay! Oh, my God, you guys. Thank these, you, Katie. These turned out so well. Yes. Seriously. Are we still recording this review? Yes. Let me see. I, I just so. want to make sure. Yes, so, it's recording. I might. I'll take a picture when they're done. Oh, first one. It's looking good so far. Sorry, guys. So, yeah, we're going to pull these up. We're going to talk while we take all these. Yes. Up. <laughs> Let's do the chargers, and then we'll do my 
race. Oh my god. And then I'm so fucking hungry. We need to go eat yes. some lunch. Yes. Oh my gosh, you guys. Seriously? These are the best things ever. There's another one of those little ever. tools somewhere over there. I know. I think I actually took yours. Here's some here. Oh. Ouch. Oh. Sorry about all the noise, guys. <laughs> We're playing with sharp. We're tools. using sharp dental picks. And they are the best thing ever. Yeah. For all kinds of things. But they are sharp. And they're round, so they roll away from you. These are so fucking These are, hilarious. Yeah. So, Lonnie, you now have like those pit slaps. <laughs> it's so classy. It is classy because it's cursive. <laughs> I'm going to take a picture of all of these when we're done because they're fucking hilarious. It's perfect. This face. This table is black, so it shows yeah. up really nicely. Sorry that some of them have, I don't know, they, I thought they were clean, but. I don't think it's not clean. I think it's old, like, scratched up glass. Yeah. Like, glass gets it's scratched up once in a while. while. Well, didn't you say you got these at, like, a thrift store or something? Or? <laughs> a garage sale, like, a million years ago. Yeah, guys, this is. Such... They were a, a dollar, and I was like, I don't know what I'm going to do with these, but I'm going to buy them. I don't know. Well, here's the I thing, and my mom. I'm a hoarder. My mom throws, like, parties that she calls soirees. Uh -huh. like especially her every year, her end of summer soiree, uh, which is in the fall when her garden's at its fullest and prettiest before everything starts to die off. And because my mom has a badass garden. Yeah. Um, here's a plate that says dipshit. And here's one that says suck it. Suck it, dipshit. Let's, see. Let's turn them all the right way. Okay. Let's flip this one around. Something just got delivered to my door. I'm sorry that my dog is barking, guys, but <laughs> these are so funny. I just had a package delivered. I, I heard the guy drop it on the doorstep. Okay, here we go. I am taking a picture. These are the best ever. Look, yeah. Larry, if you're listening to this, you know that this is happening. Uh huh. Um, you need to show up to Thanksgiving dinner because yeah. these are going to be the best things. Oh my God. I didn't think that this was going to work. Did it? Oh my god. Hold on. Let me get the middles out. Is it going to drive you crazy if I don't get these back in alphabetical order? No. Okay. Well, it maybe. Might. Okay. I'm going to do my best. But it's okay. I can fix them later, Lonnie. Here's the thing that I've learned in my 40s. <laughs> Nobody else is in charge of my weird OCD shit but me. So if something <laughs> needs to be a certain way, then I am in charge of making sure that it is that way. Because, yeah. Um, yeah, I'm gonna have to do the other vase too. Yeah, because I now have see. a vase that says smell these stinky fuckers. Oh my god, so I kind of want to get flowers on the way back from lunch somewhere, yes. just so I can have. Oh, see, but I did get see what happened, yeah, a little one over the edge, but that's okay, it actually doesn't look bad, so yeah. it's no big deal. Just maybe next time. Um, maybe I should have gotten it a little bit wider, like the, make sure you give yourself a lot out around your stencil. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's true. Make your, make my stencil wider so that it doesn't blob yes. off the edges. But I yes, didn't yes, account yes. for the fact that this is a round vase. So yeah, like this, the stuff is pretty thick, but it's not thick enough to not run. Yeah. When you're. Cause this, I like, I made a mess out of this one too that I did on my glass here. Oh wait, this goes over here. I'm gonna take a quick picture. Of... Cause see, it kind of has. Oh, but this is cute though. <laughs> it needs. I need to rinse it again. Right anyway. I'm gonna try to get a smell these a picture here. Can you pull the um the stencil away? August, look what we made. Oh, this. We're recording. <laughs> Sorry, I forgot. <laughs> Huh? It says Jesus. What do you do? Smells like egg. This is my son August. Say hi, August. We're recording. Can you hi. still smell it? It doesn't smell like egg farts in here. It smells like ass. Yeah. Um, it's a flower vase. This says smell these stinky fuckers. <laughs> and look at the look at the plates. <laughs> you serve grandma some <laughs> I think sometimes he is a little bit 
just shocked by his mother. <laughs> Whoops, did you see that? I picked the middle of an S out and it shot across the room. So you guys, this was a fucking awesome success, yeah. I think. Yes. It was very successful. Yes. Um, it was fun to do. It was pretty easy to do, actually, don't yeah. you think? Yes. It's harder to get pictures of the cups because... Yeah, it is. They're around. They roll. Uh, but yeah, I think it was I think it was a blast and it was easy to do. And again, a fucking awesome gift idea. Or like I was gonna say before August came out and or my dog barked or whatever and got me <laughs> sidetracked was uh if you find like cool shit at thrift stores or garage sales, like these little charger plates, or you go looking for them specifically, or the dollar store always has cheap shit like this. Um you can like if you're having a themed party. This would be really cool to do, like, yes. if you're having a Christmas party, you could put, like, snow snowflakes always look cool with its oh, etched glass. Yeah. Like, if you use snowflakes, if you're not into the piss flaps and the fuck off and the, all that, um, I'm yeah. going to tweet a picture and of this. Yeah, and if you're, so. like, you can get really inexpensive clear little plates and stuff from, like, yeah. Walmart and or other And this also works like on that. colored glass, too, like, like transparent colored glass. Oh, yeah, yeah. So you could do that. Oh, I have, yeah. That would be pretty. The plates we did on the back side, but I think for transparent glass, like transparent colored glass, you might want to do the etching on the front and not the back. Uh, this worked so well. I'm so excited, you guys. This was a super fun project. Lonnie, I love it when we get to do stuff together. Yes, it's so fun. Oh my God, you are putting those back. I'm right trying, but trying I too. goofed this one up. You're so fucked up. L-M-N. O-P-O-E. All right, guys, Lonnie and I are going to go eat lunch. We're starving, Marvin. Um, so we had a fun. I hope you're having an awesome Thanksgiving. You know what I realized I just did? I used the B instead of the H for cat heads, so it says cat beads. Oh, well, that's okay. <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't tell the difference. Did you say ger germy cat beads? Maybe they're like out of their, <laughs> their anal beads. They're out their butts. Yep. So sometimes we make mistakes, guys. Yep. It happens. But hey, we've got a lot of successful stuff here. This was fun. Yes. Make some cool themed party de decorations. Uh, make some cool gifts. Or just do this because it is fun. And you want to have a vase that says, smell these stinky fuckers. Yeah. Or something like that. Or have some fucking flowers. I, I, know. I have another one I to make look a at this system. again because that is so funny. You smell these stinky fuckers. <laughs> that was Lonnie's brainchild right there. That was the best. So, <sighs> happy Thanksgiving. Oh my God. And you know yeah. what I'm doing this weekend? What? Get more girls on oh. Netflix. Two new seasons, or the, the four new movie length seasons. They're they're well they're like one for season. You obviously were not into Gilmore Girls. I, I don't know. I love the yeah. shit out of Gilmore Girls, and this is this is what I my plan is for the weekend is putting up the zombie Christmas village. Nice. And putting up the Christmas tree. I'm getting ready for a craft sale. Lonnie's getting ready to do a craft <laughs> sale. Sign up for a craft sale. Wait, you are now, but it's already happened by Thanksgiving though. I know. So, yeah, that's true. So yeah. Thanksgiving weekend, though. I got some plans. It's going to be awesome. I love Thanksgiving. I think it is the delicious food-filled yeah. midway there. between I got your sense of the two best back holidays in the package. Woo You're woo. awesome. So yeah, next week, Lonnie and I are going to be back, and I don't know what we're going to be talking about because we're recording this several weeks ahead of time so that we can be with our families and doing awesome stuff for thanksgiving yay so yeah because it's like three weeks ahead three three weeks is it three weeks away i think it is and so yeah we're gonna go get lunch right now though yeah. so until next week go make some cool shit yo do it now Woo -woo. now 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 ah. gobble gobble good morning katie this is your friend i'm recording on the new task cam I'm trying to figure out what the buttons do, but every once in a while, I take a break to poo.